Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, today, the 13th of February, Holy Mother the Church calls us to the memory of St. Catherine de Ricci. St. Catherine de Ricci was born as Alessandro Romolo on the 23rd of April, 1523, 1522, in Florence of Italy. She was from a banker's family. But from her very young age, she had all her heart and mind in the Lord and she was known for her prayers and her life of commitment. Very soon, she joined the convent with a very strict rule, the Dominican convent. She joined in Prato, in her native place. But later, for that five years, she was tortured for... People misunderstood her, but later as people understood her, as time went by and as people understood her, understood her faith, they came to know that she was a real saint. And that's how she was able to bring many people towards God. Her, her specialization was basically in telling to people the love of God. After her death, people came to know the kind of life she lived. She was basically known for her ecstasies. The moments in which the Lord gave her an opportunity to suffer the pain which he suffered. The, the marks which were on the body of Jesus, few of them, would be seen on the body of uh, this great saint. And that's how Saint Catherine de Ricci stands as a symbol of someone who loved Christ so much that she could go beyond the bodily experience. We are so much taken up by the bodily experience, the feel-good factor. But saints call us to go beyond the body, go towards the spirit. Amen.